Hello. Today I will show you one of the new features of the new version of Build on the Farm. This feature is a water. With the water, you will be able to design as a better for tresses that you could have till now. And I seriously hope this will increase the fun. Of course, with the water, you will be able to do channels and simple mode. But you will also be able to build more complex systems. It's not available in this version, but in the next one, you will be also able to build doors, gates, and water pumps. All of them will interact with the water, and you will be able to build even more complex water systems. This video will present you some of the features of the world. I hope you enjoy. Okay, this is the world. Um, as you know it. Oh, there is a tree and a water. Okay, don't care. Okay, the world is crossed by a river. Uh, at both ends, the river has a less generator of water, which means you will always have some water available. You can also see that there is uh, some pool of water, which are not filled. Of course, this pool has a limited amount of water, and therefore it can be very easily emptied. Uh, I start the video by making a channel. Okay, for you to get it, uh, I have a magic pickaxe, therefore I can dig into a hole very quickly. In the game, it's a bit longer to do channel, but the idea is the same. Okay, let's get started. As you see, the water is filling the channel as I am digging into it. As fast as me, almost. And the channel is getting filled. Okay, now I'll do another channel, but I will not open it yet. Hmm. You will see the, shan the water go into the channel now. Okay, therefore with this kind of channel you can basically protect your fortress since monster cannot swim yet and expect, except for those who flies and those who are able to build uh, bridges. It's good. I'll do a pool now. Um, I'll try not to fall into it. Uh, as you see, uh, when you dig, uh, uh, so you cannot get the material. In the real version, you can get the material, of course. Okay, I have it. And the pool is filling. As you see, the channel is getting a bit emptier, and you still get filled again, slowly. Yep. Yep, the pool is filling. Okay, now I prepared a little fountain. We will have a lot of fun here. Okay, in this world I will show you two different things. Uh, I'll start again with the channel system. It's basically the same as the previous one. Open the channel. And I open the pool. The pool gets filled with water. Yep, this is working. Okay, for the next example, I made a bit more complex water system. This one. Some of you may already have recognized what it is. I look in the dictionary for the term, and it's called a siphon. It's a system which is basically 
into toilets and some other stuff. And it play with water and make water the impossible to go back. Okay, here we have a pool fill with water. And here there is two blocks that I will uh, break and the water will fall into the hole here. Um, you've got a set of block of uh, glass, therefore you will be able to see the water through the blocks. And you will see how the water behaves. The water will fall, go on the right, and eventually go up because of the pressure of the other pieces of water pushing back. And therefore the water will go up and fall into the pool. Okay, let's do it. The water is falling, filling the system, and yeah, the pressure pushes the water up. And the water going into the pool now. Um, the initial pool is getting empty. At the end, you will have only a thin layer of water remaining, and the thin layer of water will get evaporated this time. And here, okay, uh, the system stabilized, the siphon is full, and there is the same amount of water on both sides, so for the pressure, get an equilibrium, and the pool is a full. So. Okay, that's all for this video. I hope you'll enjoy it, and I seriously hope you will enjoy playing the game with this new feature. Um, stay tuned for a new video and new update of the game. See you.